And then Joe, after the fact, Joe sent Scott, the, the guy from the Firecracker Films, he sent him a bunch of hard drives to of a bunch of more footage. You know, I don't know what that is. I've not even seen it. But, but Gino... Well, let me do this. Okay, so let me... It's really hard for me to give you a number without seeing something, so I'm just trying to think. Because um, I know the footage we gave you before wasn't great, and it wasn't worth I mean, it was... I mean, that's the problem. A lot of footage we never use it, so... Right. But you own it in case this blew up again. You know, you're, you're, you're going to pretty much own all the George I mean, listen, I'm not looking for excuses from you guys. Mm -hmm. I'm not. So you could just give it to someone else also. So I'm not looking, you know. Um, it's really hard for me to say. I thought... Um, really Do you know where these guys were negotiating last time? You what? You know the numbers. Where did you end guys? up? Where did you? I know that they, they, they couldn't up, make a deal. I know they couldn't make a deal. Well, they, they couldn't make a deal because my side was demanding it might be bad. Well, I also and, thought they couldn't make a deal because the numbers were too high. Well, our numbers started out at 200 grand, and yeah. your guys, and Jeremy and those guys said no. They ended up down at, I think it was 75 grand IP rates. It took me like 25. And I was like, because the problem is this, at this point, it's so late now, um, <clears throat> let's do this, maybe what I should do is, because quite frankly, I don't want to do it for 25 grand. Either. I'm not doing it for 25 yeah. grand, I can't go too, through all that it's again. It's too uprooting, and, and, well, and Manny wants that footage for more than 25 he grand, he's the, one that, yeah, he's the one that made the offer. For the Joe footage. And my attorneys are saying, fucking take it, take it, take it. Why not give it to him? Why not give it to him? Why not give it to him? Because I don't know what he's going to do with it. I don't want some bad thing coming in. You know, that he's. I don't want a, a blackfish coming out about us. You know? Well, I think you, I think you know this much. I think you guys know this much. Tiger King Series was not a blackfish. Okay? I mean, we brought down Carol Baskin. They're in bed with Carol Baskin. Okay? Yeah, I mean, we put this... We brought her down, but she's making a shitload of money out Well, that wasn't our intent, mm -hmm. right? But we were, not, we were not out to try to make you. Um, so... <clears throat> when you assign the rights to Netflix, did you assign... What rights did you assign to Netflix? The fucking, the problem is, like, you know, listen, like I said, when I first started doing this, I never thought I would make a penny. I didn't do it because I thought it would make a penny. Mm -hmm. Most documentaries, you don't make a penny. But then shit happened that I, none of us could have expected. Joe trying to kill someone, you know. And then it became like, oh my God, this is a crazy story. So then Netflix bought it from me. Okay. I didn't make a penny off of the success of this thing, not a penny. They just bought it off of me. I thought it was like, oh, you know, at least I'm going to make a little bit of money. I had to share it with a lot of people. Um, and then it came out. And so when they bought it, they got editorial right. They got, you know, I basically gave them everything, right? Um, so I didn't, unfortunately, the way those deals work, you don't get anything on the back end. Right? Okay. So because it was so successful, I didn't get a penny. The only thing it gave me the ability to do is try to do a second, they wanted a second bunch of episodes if we could put something together, and then I had more leverage. But the first time, I got nothing, you know, comparatively. Right. And so I don't know, they have rights to everything, I think. I don't know any of them. Right? You have right, they have rights to everything that you create. But they don't have rights to the name Tiger King because that was in commerce and being used. I think you could contest that. And I, I think you should try to see what the paperwork says on that because I don't know if it's really legit. I don't know. I don't, I don't know. That I don't know. Because if they did, they would have filed for that IP in the United States and not just they in the UK. Have. I think they would have filed for that Tiger King um, IP. In the United States, and they didn't. They found further in the UK. 
Let me do this, you guys. Let's do this. Why don't I do this? Uh, maybe I, let me make a phone call because I didn't realize you had that footage. And you say you have you know, yeah, the trailer for the reality show that you did back in. It's not just a trailer. It's like a full episode. It's a full episode. Yeah. So what about you have the trailer too? Yeah. You do? Yeah. Um, I mean, look, I, I mean, I should say this, I, we don't have, we're almost done with everything, so, you know, let, you, let me, you can help us undo some of the damage in this damage. Well, no, I think I can do that regardless of the money. Okay, well, okay, the, I'm going to step back on that one because when we asked you at one point for help and then came back saying the journalistic integrity, then that part really kind of fucked us over even harder. So to say that you're going to help us on that, so I'm going to throw that one right at you. I'm going to put some substantial money when this, and that never happened. Let's go out, I'm going to be called. By the way, I have some guys here who are going to go south, but... Let me call and let me, let me just let one me just of them's go one of them's not the same guy. I stole his wallet, right? No, that was a confrontation. The guy we caught filming over there. Okay. Because even the sheriff, the sheriff said that he had a problem with that same guy. Apparently, there's a couple. Mis- yeah, there's a couple that's missing here in Thackerville that have been missing for a few I years. Literally, honestly, nothing to do with it. Okay. Um. No, we kind of blocked you guys. I mean, not blocked you, but just kind of figured, right. okay, you guys yeah. are not. Um, let me step outside. Let me make a phone call. And let me, and then I'll, I'll, just, I'll just stand outside and make a call just so I can hear. And then um, I'll come walk over to your car and try to figure it out. That's cool. Right, we'll and you want to run up and see the park that's not filming? Well, see what we're doing? <laughs> There's some that we would take. Mm-hmm. Well, I've got um, her admitting. Let was, me look I didn't at write it. that. I didn't write but that. But if we, what if we said... I'm just trying to think of it. thinking of this. Um, you know, even though you don't need this, you know that everybody wants to know what's going gonna on. He's going to say, what the fuck happened to the animals in the Jeff Lawrence? I think everybody who, everybody who we think, who, or who we know, is going to be prejudiced. So, okay, so, so I think if we both could benefit from this, so I don't know how much we can, because we sometimes shoot shit and like, don't use it. We don't fucking use it. Or we, or we get, you know, can't tell we don't need it. You know that. Like, we end up not, you, you guys now are not that really, because we didn't film you guys, you're not really part of this so much. I think it does give you the opportunity to have a platform. I think that, it, so what if I said to you, I, 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 like, you'd have to have some good faith. I'd give you half, but I'd give you 30. And I'd just give you half now. And we start by maybe just filming some of the B-roll of the place, and then we do an interview with you just about your life. You know, your dad grew up in Lansing, worked for Jeep General Motors, you know, just your mom was a teacher. You know, you had the kind of the perfect Norman Rockwell family in a way, and then you raise kids, and it just humanize you and just go through, and then, um, and then tell us about what we got wrong. I would just give you half of that. You know, you drive over like you half of it now, and it would probably take no more than two days. You know, we do a little bit today and tomorrow, and be done. And, and you just and you can be the, his guardrails, you know, just to make sure. I, I I'm not listen honestly, Jeff and Laura. I'm not trying to, you know, and I'm happy not to do it. Um, do forty. Let's look at this. Do this. I don't even know what I'm getting from. Okay. But I don't really don't want to talk about it. I just want to be like, you guys think about it, I follow you there. For, I guess if it's just for a couple days. I mean, I I'd also like to promote I'd also like to promote what your reality show is. Because I think that could be fun for both of us. Right. And if your reality show really is about like your lifestyle and sort of being it is. You know, I have a crazy lifestyle too. You know that, you made fun of me, but although You're I wasn't sleeping with nine year olds. What? What was that though? That picture of the naked kid on my Yeah. It's my, my sister's son. But he's like three for two. He's talking about that. Oh, jeez, hi. Don't scare the shit out of me. Nobody's except for me. Huh? How's it going? 
Huh? Walking on. Yeah, I'm walking on it now. And I can easily uh, walk now. Here's what I was okay. We'll do this for us to try to make this look at least cool by following us either tonight or tomorrow night. Okay. okay. These these are our security. We we need security now. These guys are security. They do John, nice to meet you. John, 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 it is the best goddamn trip that I've ever been to, isn't it? Yeah. And we just actually Are you guys from Dallas? No. Vegas. We oh, closed, also Vegas. We closed down the stream a while ago, and I didn't want to run. So the DJ comes down from the stream and says, hey, you guys, you know, you want to go to the park wall. So we're in the park. We're in the park. We're in the park. We're in the park. it's going to promote your show and it's also fun for us because obviously in the end we have to entertain people who want to have a story mm -hmm. and you guys are whether you like it or not you're a fun couple mm -hmm. or you're, like you're pretty open about it and that's what made joe fun even though he, he was even more open the time but if we could include i don't really care listen i like eric cowie but he's not that important or alan um, sure actually, but what would we, be more important in this if we made I this yeah we, we made, fired oh, you did. and i filmed up there oh you did Oh really? Mm -hmm. Okay, that would be funny. No, but see, we see, need, honey. listen, we need to entertain people. And if there's like, what was that girl saying that you, there's a girl that you guys used to hang out with in Vegas. Um, Sarah? Yeah, Sarah. Like if we could, there was even, if there was someone that would talk well about you guys, but also be like, hey, you know, like they would help promote your. I can always get Sarah to come oh, in. Or if we went to Vegas or. If there's a way to get her with you guys, or whoever. Uh, we have a girl right now. Who is the girl right now? I'm going to call Sarah. I'm sure. Because that, I think that's a win-win. It's fun for us. Lauren. Okay. How did you do? Know? 